Hello everyone, I'm Cryptic Fox, and welcome back to my kingdom. We're, of course, on Island 3 here in Kingdom 2 Crowns. Uh, I've just sort of started off with the, the basics here. Now, we we did end up even bringing over a commander and some archers and stuff from the other island we were on. I wasn't really expecting them to jump in the boat with us, but uh, we have very little money right now. So that's probably going to be one of our, our first priorities. Um, a lot of our archers are tied up being part of these units, and I don't think they'll do any hunting, unfortunately. So I think I'm going to spend my, my initial coins trying to chop down some trees... We're trying to expand uh, a little bit on the uh, the grassland that we have, so hopefully uh, hopefully we can get access to some bunnies and things, which will get us some money. Uh, I just realized my little dog followed us over, too. I didn't realize he jumped on the boat with us. That's pretty cool. So, Island 3, of course, a little bit different than Island 2. Uh, we don't have the trader in this one, so he's not bringing us any any handy free money anymore. Uh, instead, we're going to have to... Hard to make all of our own money instead, so I probably should try to find a chest sooner rather than later. Oh, there's some gems. Now we have three gems. We can work on unlocking something. We're still romancing the deer. Is it? What is this? That's a dead dude. Uh, we got a locker for two gems. I think I'm gonna hold off for a little bit. See. Oh, we got uh, these guys coming along. I probably shouldn't get hit since I don't have any money. I really don't want to lose any gems unnecessarily. We did lose a bunch before, and that was kind of a bad scenario, so let's maybe not do that. Oh, the deer is tired, though. We gotta move quickly here. Please don't get thumped. Alright, we're back safe with the sound. I do need money, though. Uh, I'm not sure exactly where I'm gonna get that from. Okay, they are still hunting a little bit. They're shooting the deer anyway. I don't know if they're gonna shoot the bunnies, but. If they could at least take these deer out, that would be good. Okay, well, there's a little bit of money. Uh, we do have some new, uh, some new units coming in, so we'll maybe recruit some more archers. We're actually fairly well defended here, just by bringing over those troops that we had at the last base. It's interesting having a commander this early on, because we, we didn't have those before. Uh, these guys obviously aren't anywhere here. They must have continued on their way. Oh, let's uh, maybe hire another one of you. I only have a bunch of gems, buddy. I'm sorry. I gotta go find a chest. To, something that might have a little bit of money in it. Well, we didn't find a chest, but I did find a portal. So I'm gonna stay clear of that for right now. I can't really afford to get hit at the moment, so we'll just try to try to avoid that. That's all we can find on the left. Uh, I guess we'll look out to the right. We do at least have a recruitment camp right here. That's not too far away. I really just need some money before we can do any more hiring, though. Uh, somebody's been doing a little bit of hunting anyway. We've got, got a tiny bit of... A tiny bit of coins here. I think the, the rabbits have been spawning a tiny little bit here. We did open up a whole lot more grassland, so there's more bunnies way out here. If we can get our hunters actually coming out to get them. Man, there's, like, bunnies way out here. Where'd all the trees go? I swear, I chopped down, like, two trees, and now we've got, like, this thing clear all the way through to the boat. That seems super unusual, but I'll take it. I mean, that's a lot of grassland for our guys to hunt in, as long as I can get some people to do the actual hunting. There we go. We finally have some money. See what else there is to unlock over here. Ooh, what is this? Uh, all right, so this is one of the buff statues. This now we, we've had farming, we've had archers. Uh, maybe this one will be for like builders or something. Yeah, it's some sort of a buffing for builders. I don't, I don't know what that's gonna do exactly, but we have it nevertheless. And I have my trusty dog here to bark at me if in case there's anything coming ahead of us. Oh, more gems. That'll be handy. Uh, we just passed another house that we could unlock, too, but that's going to take four gems, which I don't have. And we just, oh, let's get out of here. There are a serious number of bunnies here. I need to get some archers. Um, I did hire at least one more person. We've got a couple of normal archers here, so that's good. They're out hunting. Um, let's get some more bows on hand. We've got at least one guy waiting. No, no, give me that back. So we got four bows ready. Um, not necessarily because we need them for defense, because actually we have these guys and they're doing a pretty good job. But mostly just because I need I need regular hunters out there actually shooting bunnies. Give me some, earn me some money. And we're down to gems already. Man, the life of a of an impoverished king, I tell you. Oh look, there's like this stuff's all like got a glowy effect now. That must be because of the statue that we updated. So maybe what it's doing. This is increasing the durability of the structures and stuff we've made, which is actually pretty cool. Oh, there comes the moon. My time has arrived. Uh, I would like to upgrade this, because I, I really have nothing camp-wise. But fortunately, we do have some, you know, some stronger battlements, I guess, because of the buff. Oh, man, look at all the... That must have been all from bunny power. Yeah! Good job, guys. Uh, let's... Oh, there goes another guy to get some, another bow for hunting. 
Let's get this started. Get an actual camp going on in here. We have enough coins, I think, actually, to upgrade it again, but I don't think we can do that all at the same time. Uh, let's get some towers in here, too. We seem to have... I mean, we have extra archers anyway, so... Get some of this going on. Uh, the attack's already done, so we can go roaming a little bit. I'm going to go a little bit farther out to the right and see what we can find. Now, the, we did run into the portal over there, but... Uh, now that I have a few more coins, I might be able to go past the portal and see what's out there. Oh, there's another recruitment camp way out here. This is just past the portal, so I'll throw these down and see what we can get. Right, give me my coin back. There's always one guy that's trying to take two coins. Uh, I thought I had some bows ready, but I, apparently not. Oh, music change. Take a little snack. Oh, uh, we gotta recharge up so we can run without running out of stamina again for a bit. Oh, yes, more gem or more coins rather. We needed these for sure. I do want to get past the. Oh, there's another portal. All right, so that's at least two on this side already. Uh, oh, I thought that was gonna be the dock, but it's not. We got way out here. All right, then the cave. So there's two portals, and then the and then the mountain or cave entrance over there. Uh, on the right hand side, on the left hand side, we've seen at least one portal. Oh, he actually runs. He runs more slowly when he's not in the woods. That's interesting. I'm seeing too many deer, so I'm gonna rant, romance some of these, and we'll try and bring them back with us if we can. Okay, our guys have been really busy hunting down the bunnies. I did bring some deer back with me, too. Uh, so I got a couple more things to shoot at. That's pretty insane, though. Um, the sheer amount of coins I just got from... Oh, man, my, actually, my coins are full. I'm trying to drop a few of these in there on the ground, let them pick them up. Um, we'll get a couple more bows. We did have those guys running over this way. Maybe I'll do some more builders here, too, because I'm not entirely sure how many of those I brought with me on the boat. Uh, we're ready to upgrade here again. So we'll get that popped up. I was hoping it would actually do an auto-upgrade on my walls, but that's clearly not going to happen. So let's, uh, let... ooh, it is nighttime. I was going to do a, a manual upgrade there, but I don't think we're going to get a chance. Uh, and unfortunately, we have plenty of archers behind the walls, so even though they're not upgraded, we probably shouldn't have too much trouble with the greed this time around, I don't think. Oh yeah, they're making short work of them. They have just so many, so many arrows they can shoot out there, it's crazy. All right, uh, that's done. Let's uh, let's go ahead and we're gonna upgrade, upgrade, the, upgrade this tower by one. Uh, we'll upgrade the wall, and then I think we'll do the same thing on the other side. Uh, and then I'd like to upgrade that center encampment there if we can too. Uh, let's get the tower first. All right, I feel like we're getting low on coins again already. Let's see what the deal is over here. Now we did have that. Uh, Whatever that, I don't know, the Fallen Warrior or whatever it was over here uh, that we had an opportunity to unlock, and I, I have enough gems to do it, so I think I'm going to see what the deal is here. Oh, dude! It's like some crazy warhorse or something. That's pretty cool. Um, but it made, like, some ghostly sound. I wonder if it's supposed to be, like, a ghost horse or something. Oh, my, look at the coins it takes to take the... All right, I'm not going to be taking that anytime soon. <laughs> Frankly, I just don't have the money for it. Uh, I think this deer is already in love with me, so we'll bring him back. Like a deer to the slaughter. We'll get some extra coins in that one. Uh, I did send a couple peasants back toward town, so we probably should be aware of what they're up to. Uh, we should probably should try to trim some trees here, too, and try to expand a little bit on this side. And we have plenty of grassland on the other side. It's not really a huge deal, but... This will help a little bit, anyway. Come on, deer. Come meet my friends. I'm sure they're going to love you for dinner. Uh, somebody actually hit him. That would be great. No? Bueller? Oh, seriously? <laughs> okay, come back here. We're not done with you yet. They didn't get a good enough opportunity to say hello. Oh, one down. There we go. We got him enchanted. Just get... get oh, there we go. Finally. Oh, three coins. I thought it was only two you got from the deer, but... We nailed a few of them, so that's good. Um, now, from what I've seen, they, the uh, the green will actually leave the towers alone if there's a bigger tower they can go after that's like beyond it. So I'm going to build a little tower on either side of the wall. Uh, I know it's going to take an archer way, but we've, we've kind of added a few of those anyway. And this way, when the green run past, they'll get to uh, shoot at them from both sides, from inside the wall and from outside. Get some pot shots on them as they're running by, too. I think will be good. 
Okay, what do we gotta do for upgrading in here? No, two, four, six, eight. Wait a minute, we need 12 coins. I don't think I have 12 on me. Ah, oh, close, we got like 10. They were shooting some more bunnies over here, so I think we should be in good shape. Uh, now this one, I'm, I'm quite certain, will give us a wall upgrade when we upgrade the center keep here. There we go. It's not stone yet, but it's wood. Oh, I already upgraded the walls. All right, well, never mind. I guess we're not gonna get an upgrade then. We have our banker guy, though, so now when we get, like, a surplus of cash, we've got that. That is an opportunity. I do need to expand outwards, though, when we're not gonna get any of these new buildings that we're gonna need. I'm curious to see whether the grasslands will remain if I build a wall, like, way out here, because I kind of need... kind of need something. Man, where can I even build a wall? Okay, here's where we can build our first farm, and I probably should. And then this is the first wall we can build beyond that. Oh, here comes the greed. Let's get out of here. You didn't give me early warning, dog! Alright, we'll start a farm out here. No, I don't have a wall defending this thing. So I'm not sure how the greed are going to treat it exactly. I, I think they'll probably run past it, but I don't know. Maybe we put a farm out there. Start to earn a little bit of money. Uh, these guys are doing actually alright on the hunting and stuff, but... Any extra cash we can make, I think, would be good. It takes a lot to run a kingdom. Oh, what is this? Something else I can unlock with a gem. Do I, ha I have a gem for it. Oh. There's another horse. Uh, alright. So there's like two mounts we've unlocked. On this level. That's super weird. Uh, we have the farm started. I could upgrade it, but we don't even have scythes yet. So I'm not really in a huge rush to do that. Let's, um... Go back the other way here. See if we can expand the wall out and try to get uh, a place we can make scythes. Now, I, I also want to get pikemen because they're amazing. They're great for defending, plus they also earn some money too, which is kind of like an added bonus. Uh, we do have a peasant who's running around not doing anything, so it would be a good opportunity to have... Oh. Everybody's running back inside. It's nightfall. All right, we're going to put a wall out here, though, in the morning. Once we get uh, once we get past the, the evening wave of, of greed... Yeah, so the greed do seem to just run right past that tower. Now, maybe because there's a, a bigger tower here already. So he basically gets free shots. Just kind of shrink the enemy a little bit before they even get over here. Um, not that it matters, because we're going to put a wall here right now anyway. But that was kind of cool. I'm really curious to see, once we build this wall, if this grassland disappears. If it does, that is kind of a challenge. Because you need to expand to the right side to repair the boat. And if it gets rid of all the bunnies, then that's kind of a big... Oh, yeah, that disappeared all right. If we nuke all the bunnies, then we run out of opportunities to make a fair amount of money. All right, we can knock down some more trees. Keep keep pushing out our border over on this side. I'm going to leave, like, two trees intact over here. Because uh, I want the camp followers to still hang out. Come join our forces. Keep swelling my troops over here, as it were. Um, this wall needs to be upgraded. Uh, I think we're going to need to build a wall on the other side. I was kind of trying to delay a little bit. But I think we'll do one right over here where we can defend it. Uh, we're going to lose our, our, one, uh, our one little bunny spawning area in here. But hopefully this will give me access to the pikemen. We did get the, uh, the farmers on the other side. So hopefully this will give us the pikemen on this side. Uh, and then I guess we could put another tower out here. Or something. I don't, I don't want to build a tower too close to the farm because I want them to be used a lot of farmland in here, but you know, we'll see what happens. I'm going to upgrade that wall right away so that's uh, at least a decent shape, and then I think we'll upgrade the farm out here too. Get some serious money generation because my, my, uh, my purse is a little on the empty side. It's funny, there's so many bunnies out here, but I'm broke. Doesn't seem like a good situation. I think there might have been a farmer who was outside the wall. I thought they would take shelter inside this shack out here, but uh, maybe they didn't. So we probably should keep pushing out this way. I think I'm going to knock down some more trees. See if we can get access to another, another wall and another tower placement here. 
there is a, a tower thing here. The next wall is like out there, I think. Unless there's somewhere behind this brush here, there might be another one that we can set up. I just hope that if we if we set up way out there and can maybe skip over some of these, and hopefully, hopefully the uh, the grasslands will remain intact, and we can continue to hunt those. I mean, I don't really want to have to give up the bunnies just yet. I think we have enough coins to upgrade our, our central keep, which should force an upgrade to these first set of walls to, to stone, if I'm not mistaken. Hopefully we have enough. I think we're good. Yeah. All right, so that upgrades that to stone. Yeah, it does automatically upgrade these walls to stone. Now, it's not going to do the outer walls, but uh, we'll need to upgrade those eventually. Also, as long as we have the defenses here initially, I think that's a good start. Um, now, I really wonder where the pikemen show up. Maybe the pikemen... Let's see if they appeared over here on the right now. Maybe they only show up once you get to a certain level. Nope. I don't know. I think we got to expand our walls out farther still. Our farmers are getting a nice crop going out here, so that's good. Hopefully they'll take shelter at night. I don't, I don't really see them. Oh, wait. Are they going inside? Tell me you're going in hiding. Nope, they're just sort of standing there. Guys, you gotta go inside or something. The greeter can come along this way and then... they gonna take your scythe. They don't want that. No, seriously, I wanna see what happens to these guys. Are they gonna hide or is they gonna hit them? Oh no, it definitely hits them. Alright, that's super lame. Alright, we need to build a wall out there. I thought for some reason they would hide inside that shelter, but clearly they're not going to. Alright, let's get some serious farming going on now. Uh, we have a couple peasants walking around not doing anything, plus the uh, the couple there that unfortunately had their, their size taken from them, so we'll get like four of them going here, I think. Um, and then... I'm going to expand out past where the farm is so we can put up a wall, because I need to defend that. That's going to be a really good source of income for me. Do you guys have any money to aim me? A little bit. A little bit, not a lot of it. Uh, yeah, grab you, grab you, all these farmers that unfortunately got their... Backside's tanned. Um, so I guess we'll build a wall right here. We'll let all of our forces move up this far, and then hopefully all this grassland that's back here will all get converted into farmland. That would be kind of handy. I don't know how far the farmers will go from the shack. I could build a tower there, but I don't think I'm going to. We might use some of this farmland in here, too, I guess. That'd be all right. Actually, I probably shouldn't have built there. I probably should have just gone even farther and gone out past the boat, because we're going to need to build out here anyway. Knock back the trees here, and that'll give us uh, more hunting ground. Since we kind of gobbled up a whole bunch. I'm really curious to see whether the grass is going to stay intact behind, behind the wall. I, I think it kind of goes away. But on the plus side, we at least have the farms there. Yeah, it seems all the grass does definitely disappear, but that's okay. As long as we have the farms, I guess. And then uh, we'll try to get some grasslands on the outside of the wall so they can hunt from there. And I don't think I'll expand the walls too much farther over this, this side, anyway. After this one's done, I think I'll try to upgrade this one right away. And then we'll go back and see if that finally gave us access to the pikemen, because those are the guys I really want to get a hold of. Where'd that coin go, buddy? Cop it up. I don't know what these workers are doing. Why are they just hanging out by the horse? I can take the horse. I'm really curious what this horse does. I'm, I think I'm going to swap to it just to, just to see what the deal is. Where'd you go, buddy? I don't have the option anymore. Oh, there we go. Okay, this looks like like a plow horse or something for farming. I don't know. Maybe it just has really good stamina or something? Uh, we'll see. It's going to be hard to compete with that big deer. Well, I didn't want to knock this camp down too soon, but... 
I, I really seem to need to keep expanding outward because I still don't have access to the pike pit. I'm not sure why. I've expanded so far on the other side. Let's chop this down. I'm sure there'll be another recruitment place a little bit farther we could probably go after. I've gotten kind of more peasants at the moment than I know what to do with because we brought so many with us when we came on the last boat ride. Uh, so we'll have to take care of that, I guess. I think I'm going to ride... Uh, the next On the next daybreak, I think I'm going to ride out past the port on the left-hand side. And we'll see what's over there. Uh, if we can get our palace or our castle, whatever you want to call it, upgraded here. This is not much of a palace. We can get our shack upgraded over here to something a little bit more royal. Uh, then we can maybe get another commander and we can have a force big enough to actually go out and start attacking some of those portals and knock them down as well. Oh, here we go. I finally have the pikemen. I don't know at what point this showed up. But we have access to it at least. So let's hire some pikemen. Set up for five of them. No, I, I, I did hire a few peasants, so we might have a couple of them who'll grab the pikes at least. I'm hoping there'll be a couple more there, because I, I hired a few that I didn't give jobs right away. I was kind of holding off a little bit, hoping that I'd get access to the pikemen finally, and it's at least it's finally here. Decent-sized farmland growing here, too. <coughs> and on this side, I knocked down quite a few trees. Uh, we have some more grassland that's available. All way, pretty much all the way to this uh, relic, or whatever you want to call it. Sounds pretty good. Oh, I was going to romance that deer, and I just remembered I can't do that. I'm on, the wrong, I'm on the wrong mount. I don't know what the deal is with this one. I don't know what the, what the benefit's supposed to be. It's like a farm nag or something. So it's a neat little horse, but I think I'm going to switch back to the deer. Because uh, I like the idea of uh, bringing in deer from from hunting. Okay, yeah, we did get, we did have a few pikemen that I could set up. So they should be wandering around here. Well, actually, they're probably fortifying the walls at the moment. Uh, but they will provide some extra income for us because they're going to do fishing out of the river, which is really, really handy. All right, we'll pass the first port on the left, and I found some more gems. That's handy. There's three more gems. Um, ooh, and a chest of coins, too. Again, very, very handy. I'm not actually not actually generating a ton of wealth right now, so that's really good. Oh, good, there is another encampment out here. Uh, now, they're not running, so I don't think I have any weapons set up for them. Oh, there is another gate here. So there's at least two gates on this side. And then there should be a third one. Oh, yeah, a third one on the dock there. So we've got a lot of work cut out for us. We've got a lot of gates to knock down over here. Once we knock down that last one at the end there, apparently we can build a lighthouse. And that lets us sail safely with our, our boat back and forth between the different islands, which will come in really handy. If we can use some of those gems to unlock things uh, from an earlier island, that would be really cool. All right, they've been busy hunting. We actually got quite a few coins between that the chest that I found and then the bunny hunters. We're doing quite good. I did bring a couple deer back with me as well, so we'll see whether they get a chance to knock those down. Upgrade to our actual little castle keep kind of thing. Should you go try and collect the rest of the coins? Oh yeah, these guys are rich. They're doing some serious bunny slaying. Thank you. All right, I think we're ready to... Uh, I, have another, I have at least one more peasant coming back, so I think we're ready to put another shield up on the left-hand side here. We'll create another another knight commander unit. And we can go out on the assault. Uh, we're going to attack the left side first because I want to get I want to get that dock secured so we can build a lighthouse over there. I'm trying to make some use out of that. Oh, we have access to building a catapult over here now, too. Um, so let's go ahead and do that. Catapult's only on the one side, though. I don't have the thing for building the catapult on the other side, unfortunately. And I don't know that I want to expand too much farther on the left-hand side, because that side is actually giving me access to some nice grasslands for bunny hunting. <laughs> yeah, doing good work with that pike there. That's awesome. Seems like the pike's just about a guaranteed hit, which is great. Need more of those guys. They defend, they produce money. They're pretty much good all around. Okay, I think uh, that if that attack is done. We should have two commanders here now, if I'm not mistaken. 
Uh, yes. So let's go out on the assault. We'll take out our first gate over here. Uh, we have plenty of troops back home to defend. Uh, I'm a little low on coins. <laughs> if you guys could, could maybe snag some for me, that, that would be great. Come on. You really gotta improve your aim, buddy. There we go. Oh, actually, I'm not that low on coins. For some reason, I thought my purse was almost empty. But we're good. Uh, we'll make sure these guys have coins on them. Alright, he's got one. I think they should both have them now, but I'm just gonna double check. Oh man, that guy's actually got a few. Alright. I guess you can give him a few coins. I kind of want to try this other horse out. But it's so expensive. I don't have the coins for it. Alright, there's our first gate. Portal's opening up. These guys will land it with the arrows, and then we'll uh, we'll just stay on hand here. And then that way, if the if the greed happen to hit our little commanders at the front there, we can restock them with coins. Make sure that they stay alive. All right, our first portal is down. Uh, let's open this up. Now, this is gonna give us access to that uh, teleporting thing, Majigi. Well, whenever the builders get out here to fix it. It's actually it's getting pretty late in the day. I hope they don't come running out now, because that'd be awful, but then the next portal opens. Come here, dear. Oh, the builders are going out now, and that's bad. <laughs> I hope they don't get killed on the way out there. Oh my gosh, look at the money these guys had on them. That's insane. They must... Oh, oh it's going to overflow. All right, I threw some on the ground so it wouldn't overflow, but... They must have just an insane number of bunnies they're slaughtering. Now, let's give these guys a fire barrel over here. We're losing coins anyway. Might as well get another pike ready. Um... I can't afford to ride over there because there's too many coins on the ground. That's from all the pikemen running around, I think. I need the banker to come out so I can throw some cash at him. Uh, we can't upgrade the keep again, I don't think. No, we need whatever those bricks are. Or what we're going to need next. Uh, have I got room for two coins? Uh, it's getting, getting a little close in there. Maybe we'll set up another farmer. All right, I don't see any greed coming tonight, uh, at least not on the left-hand side, so let's uh, send out another assault force. Uh, never mind, the day's already started again. I've got so many coins on me, though. Uh, the banker should be out and about now. You'll pardon my English accent. And uh, we'll give him some coins. All right, now I can go catch up with the rest of my forces. Munching some grass here so I stay... Nice stamina. We'll go catch up to them and see what's going on. I mostly just want to be on hand so I can feed coins to those commanders in case they get hit by the greed, but for the most part, they handled that last gate without really any real issues. They only had to resupply like one coin. I kind of want to try this new horse. And I have, don't have nearly enough coins. Oh, wait. Did, did it vanish? Oh, it moved. Oh, uh, we're close. We're close, but not quite enough coins. And that portal's open, so that's good. Alright, here's portal number two. Get to work, guys. Jeez, they might, that, that deer might even die from collateral damage. Come on, pick up those coins. Make sure you're equipped, guys. Make sure you're equipped. Oh my gosh, there's a whole bunch there. I kept the coins handy on the ground, but it, did they kill any of my guys? No? Nope. They didn't even need to pick them up. That's cool. I think that was a normal nighttime wave that just came out. Like, once, when you start attacking the gate, they, they naturally come out anyway, but I think that was actually a nighttime wave that came out there in the middle of that. Uh, they're doing good work. Nice! Gate number two is down. 
I wonder if this builds the same portal. I imagine it probably does. We already have one portal. I don't know that I really need two, but... Alright, uh, they're gonna head back. That leaves the last portal on this side being the one on the dock, which I gather is just open now. The bunny wealth just keeps rolling in. My purse is full again. That's insane. Uh, I hired a couple more peasants. They should be on the run, but we'll uh, throw up some more bows just to make sure they're on the way. Oh, and I should actually throw... Well... Let's just say we do another commander on the, on the, the right side there, but I guess we really don't need it. Clicked up the, some of the cash we've got laying on the ground over here, because I'm sure there's going to be a little bit. Uh, we did do some harvesting, I'm sure, at this point. So our farmer should have a bunch of coin for us. Oh, too much, too much. Whew. All right, where's that banker? I need to I need to fill him up. Oh, these farms are really starting to produce the coins now. Leave a few behind there. I've actually I've given like two or three loads of coins into the bankery over here now, but I think we're gonna need to give even more because those farms are paying out in spades now. Where'd the banker go? There you are. Come on, buddy, I got more money for you. Oh, man. <laughs> I've got more coins than I know what to do with now. This is insane. Oh, we just lost one. Oh, he caught it. Nice. That one was going to fall in the water for sure. Okay. Um, take more of these. Oh, he gave me some of the back. I don't want the back. I'm trying to unload my purse. Oh, no. They're giving me more money. <laughs> The farmers and everybody are just unloading all the cash on me. That's insane. I've given the banker, I don't know, I think six or seven loads of coins now. So I, I think we're doing okay money-wise. Uh, <laughs> this is definitely the richest I've been in this game. I, I think I'm going to upgrade this tower. Why not? It's here. We'll upgrade it. Uh, as soon as this assault ends tonight, we're taking this big bank of coins and we're... Or, we're going to head out and try and get that gate that's all the way down at the dock. Of course, I destroyed the tower before the wave, but that's all right. Pikeman will do their work, I think. There's another one with a different mask on there. All right. Assault is done. Let's get underway, guys. Go smash that gate on the dock so we can build ourselves a lighthouse. We made our way all the way out to the dock, and it actually looks like it's still daytime, so that's good. I mean, they can sort of assaulting this thing during the day. Let's throw some coins down here so these guys are handy. For when they need to be. Hopefully they'll pick up the coins automatically, and then I won't have to deal with trying to resupply them only when they get injured. Oh, man. Ah, oh, they stole the coins! All right, maybe that wasn't such a good idea. I suppose I kept them from hitting my guys because they... All right, well, whatever. We'll leave, the, we'll leave a couple coins on the ground there. Maybe I overdid it. Just threw too many down. I don't want them to lose too many coins, though, because I actually kind of need them. We're going to need them to build a lighthouse out here, I think. All right. We successfully smashed the last gate on this end. Actually, it doesn't take that many coins to build the lighthouse out here. I'm one coin short! No! Like, the one coin that the greed stole from me. Oh, wait a minute. Alright, now I'm confused. But that was the lighthouse. Okay, good. Oh, wait. I gotta, I gotta put more into it? What's the deal there, exactly? I'm not sure what the, what the deal is with the, the upgrades there. And this one here, I guess, is probably the portal to, to teleport all the way back. But why you would have this here to do further lighthouse upgrades, I'm not sure. Nevertheless, that went really well. We've we've smashed all three of the gates on the left-hand side now, so I don't think we have to worry about any of the greed enemies on the left side anymore. Now it's just going to be the ones that are on the right. And just enough coins to hire that guy. I think I'm completely out of coins now. But poverty doesn't last long in this kingdom. These guys are just making insane amounts of money for me. Um, so they're, they're slaying all kinds of bunnies and getting all kinds of coin. <laughs> like this. They, they, they routinely have more money than I can carry. Plus the pike are throwing it down. Like we're basically building a whole palace of gold here. 
Oh my gosh, they're feeding me more money. No, don't. No, stop it. Stop it. I can't take anymore. These guys have like the Midas touch. Uh, I'm just going to keep feeding this guy coins. He can keep stashing it inside our keep. We're going to build like a huge palace of gold here. The farmers just, they're, they're actually coming long range now to try to give me money. Because they're like, I can't care anymore. You've got to take some. Please, my liege. Take my monies. Have we got enough yet? Take more. I don't... I wonder if there's any limit to how many she can put inside here, because I've, I've still got an almost full purse, and I've just thrown him insane amounts of money. Um, I still have guys who aren't doing anything either. Let's get some more pikemen, because, you know, when you've got a problem with having too much money, why not get more? Speaking of, um, well, a portal opened. That's weird. Oh my gosh, look at all the money they're throwing at me. Tell me the gate's still open. I need to, uh, I need to give this guy more cash. My purse is full. No! Alright, well, I guess we could use another commander on this set anyway, so we'll set that up. Uh, we might as well set up some more fire barrels, because, frankly, we need to spend the money. Uh, let's upgrade a tower. And I guess we're in a position now where, I mean, I have enough coins I could start throwing it into the, into the ship construction, even though I'm not ready to leave the island yet. Because I want to smash those gates on the other side. Oh my gosh, look at this money. It's insane, really. All right. Well, I'm losing money left, right, and center here. Okay, so I'm gonna keep uh, I'm gonna keep stashing gold inside of our inside of our little castle here. I think we made pretty good progress today. When we come back next time, we'll uh, we'll worry about building up the boat and we'll smash the gates on the other side before we even consider moving on to the next island. So this could be basically the first place that we actually conquer. But thanks again, everyone, for checking out the video. If you don't currently subscribe, please feel free to click on that subscribe button. Come back and check out the next video. I'm, as always, Cryptic Fox. I'll see all of you next time.